This is back on the Myco trailer. We've uh, got the wheels pulled. Got all the pinstriping pulled off. We did add uh, some more bunk mounts. As you can see. Got the Myco letters all peeled off. That adhesive will have to be sandblasted off. Acetone wouldn't touch it. Pinstripes used acetone. Wiped the glue off. Got rid of this jack that was all slopped up on here. This will be filled in, smoothed back up. And then there'll be a plate put on here with a better jack. So now we're in the process of getting ready to sandblast. Once we get it sandblasted, it'll get primed. And then uh, it's going to get a coating of uh, a urethane Raptor liner. It's a really hard bed liner coating. Should give this trailer a really good salt. Uh, protection for salt water so we'll get some more video footage here as our steps as we go so yeah we're in the process of sandblasting just trying to get rid of all the rust <sighs> these fenders I'm cleaning them up pretty good just a little cheap harbor freight job it's doing a trick that had those tread strips. We're trying to get that adhesive and everything off. Trying to blast those out of the way. Yeah, we we'll shoot the primer on her. We run out of primer. Had to use a little bit of rust reforming primer. We got her shot. Next thing is to let this cure, and then we'll be putting the uh, Raptor liner on it. Most of the outside was sandblasted, touched the inside, the bad spots. Let's see how she turns out. So, continuation of the paint job. We got her inside here. We finally got her all painted up. Took uh, four gallons of Raptor liner to paint this trailer. This stuff does a nice job. Once it cures, 
it uh, you can almost file your fingernails on it used high temp paint on the drums give a nice offset for the tires well, there she is all we did was <clears throat> shoot this with a Schultz gun we're not sponsored or anything but Raptor liner by no means I've used this product for a few years and it is uh, some nice stuff that's all we used and uh, there's the gun we shoot it on with it shoots a nice texture finish like I say you can pretty much file your fingernails on it once it cures rock shouldn't be chipping this trailer up again so just kind of giving you a follow-up on the trailer we've got it all stripped down the jacks off of it the winch everything's off of it tires wheels everything lights wiring we're going to redo all that so just kind of giving you all a follow-up stay with us folks don't forget like share subscribe all that good stuff we need uh we need all the subscribers we can get we're uh we're hoping to hit a thousand this year and we got a long ways to go